Roger Goodell, you're so fired, bro. Everyone in the world has confirmed that the NFL witnessed the Ray Rice knockout elevator video prior to its public release by TMZ on Monday. That is everyone but Roger Goodell. All right, bro, we'll give you a shot. Here are the three possible scenarios surrounding the NFL's involvement in this Ray Rice knockout video. Scenario number one. This isn't a good one for you, Raj. Roger Goodell did see the Ray Rice elevator knockout video prior to its public release and has lied about it and has covered it up ever since then. If this is true, Roger Goodell needs to immediately issue a public apology and then be fired by the NFL owners. Not this bullshit resigning stuff either. Fired. Scenario number two, that Roger Goodell did not view the Ray Rice elevator knockout video, but someone in the NFL offices did. Well, get ready to hear this quote. Not to my knowledge. Except you won't be able to hide behind that, dick face. You see, when you're the head of an organization and you were paid $44 million last year, hold on, Roger Goodell made $44 million last year. Do you know who the highest paid player in the NFL was last year? It was Aaron Rodgers and he made $22 million. So when you're that leader of an organization, anything that happens in that organization under your watch, you are responsible for. In fact, that's the same exact thing you said to Sean Payton right before you suspended him for an entire season. Karma is a bitch. Finally, scenario number three, that every single NFL reporter and TMZ and the Associated Press and all of them are liars and that they are all making up a big lie and it's a giant conspiracy to bring down Roger Goodell because that's what they wanna do and that their stories although they've never changed that since back in March up until today, never changed. They're all liars. They're lying. Liar. Yeah, that scenario number three doesn't seem like it's gonna work there, Raj. 